Hi, I'm Mark, and here at Hay Needle, we understand when buying light bulbs, it can seem like the selection is endless. So to shed a little light on the variety of bulbs and their uses, I'm here to give you a quick rundown so you can make a confident and informed decision. So let's start with the traditional incandescent bulb. This has been the go-to everyday lighting source since Edison first demonstrated it in 1880. New technologies have spawned more energy efficient and money saving alternatives. Keeping with federal regulations that have stopped production on 75 and 100 watt incandescent bulbs, the same will now happen with the 40 and 60 watt bulbs beginning January 1st, 2014. Although it will not be illegal to have the bulbs in your home, they will be increasingly difficult to find, which is why we suggest transitioning to more energy and cost efficient lighting sources. Similar to the incandescent, the halogen bulb also uses a filament. However, it's enclosed in a capsule filled with halogen gas under high pressure. This allows the filament to burn hotter with less energy, making it more efficient. Halogens produce bright light closest to natural daylight, just like incandescents, but can last nearly twice as long, up to 3,000 hours. They were great in pendant lights, recessed cans, and in places where bright light is needed, such as under cabinets. Another common light source are fluorescent bulbs. They're powered by mercury vapor, which emits UV light when electricity is applied. The inner coating turns the rays into a flat, visible light that almost appears bluish. To eliminate flicker and hum, a ballast outlet is required to operate. Plus, they use 20 to 40 percent less energy than an incandescent and have a lifespan up to 3,000 hours. They're a popular choice in large areas, such as basements and commercial buildings. Also, since they contain mercury, they must be disposed of properly. A great alternative to the incandescent is the CFL, or Compact Fluorescent Bulb. You may recognize the unique spiral design. As the name suggests, they are a smaller version of the fluorescent since they are powered by electric current that flows through the gas in the tube. They can last up to 10 times longer than an incandescent while consuming a quarter of the energy. And since they are equipped with a common base, they fit most lighting fixtures such as lamps, ceiling fans, and wall sconces. Another replacement for the incandescents are the LEDs. These super bulbs are powered by electrical current that illuminate tiny little light sources called light emitting diodes, hence the name LED. These last longer than any other light source, with some lasting up to 45,000 hours. This means you may never have to replace with normal use. Until recently, their use has been limited, but they are constantly being developed for more home applications other than directional lighting. An additional lighting choice is the High Intensity Discharge, or HID, bulb. This produces light when an arc passes between cathodes in a pressurized tube. There are four main types and they are extremely energy efficient with lifespans up to 20,000 hours. They require a balance to operate and take time in warming up, so they're ideal for lighting along streets, parking lots, and for outdoor security. Our last option is the Parabolic Anodized Reflector, or PAR bulb. This allows you to direct light more precisely and puts off about four times as much light as an incandescent. PAR bulbs are commonly used in recessed and track lighting. However, due to the weatherproof casing, they're also suitable for use in outdoor flood and spot fixtures as well. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about the wide variety of light bulbs we offer at hayneedle.com. We hope you can now make an even more informed decision when choosing your next bulb.